playing some more Zwarin Wilderness, so I was actually going to do a game review on Ridge Racer for the PS1, but uh, my AV Teddy decided to fuck up on me. But anyway, so we are starting off from where we left off in the last part. Pat. <laughs> so, um, yeah. What were we going to do? I think we were. I think I remember saying that we were going to like make the dining area for the little like kingdom area. So let's go over back over. Go over back over. <laughs> Alright, let's go over to the Imperial Furniture Store and buy some tables and maybe some plates or whatever. I don't know. <laughs> or maybe go loot some plates or something like that. Because, you know, I feel like it. Alright, so shut up. But anyway, yeah. Um, uh, yesterday I did a video with uh, the Bow Rifle uh, <laughs> on SCP Contemporary Breach. Oh my god, that was fucking hilarious. That was. Oh, that's the best video I've done in a long time. It's just so funny. Um. I, the reason why it was so funny because we were just joking around and we weren't taking the SCP container breach so seriously. Uh, it was just so funny. It was ridiculous. Oh man. But anyway, so um, let's go and buy some tables because I feel like I it. Interest you in some of my work. <sighs> I keep on forgetting to actually, you know, fix this. Uh, we're gonna need some chairs, so. Black giant dining. Well, we only need to buy one because we can actually, you know, duplicate it, which would be cool. Uh, uh, I'll buy an armchair. Well, for me. And then I will be. Uh, bye bye bye. And what else do we have here? Then's. Uh, then's I would buy. Um, one Imperial chair because obviously, you know. Oh, I'm gonna negotiator. shut up. I'm speaking, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'll buy one of those just for the hell of it. And I'll buy. Wait, is that the right one I need? Is that fine? Large? Yeah, I think that's. Uh, shit. I don't know. Yeah, I'll buy it. I got a load of tents anyway. Um, actually, I could buy some weapons. Um. Shelf racks, actually, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, I'll buy one of those, and I'll buy one of those. There is like a mod which you, which you can actually, you know, where you can. Um, oh no, I'm gonna be over encumbered, aren't I? Oh, okay, you over there. Um, yes, you. Uh, I think you're the one I gave. No, you over there. Yes, you. What? I swear I gave you. You gotta be kidding me. What? Fuck. Hang on a minute. I know this isn't, I'm not cheating, guys. I'm just, you know, checking something out quickly. I gave you. Ah, there we go. Yeah, he's the guy who I give all my stuff to. <laughs> go, go, go. And go there as well. And there, and there. Uh, basically, guys. Hey, you fuck's sake, right? <laughs> right, I'll be right back, guys. Um, basically, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna buy this stuff again because obviously I just picked that up, and now they're gonna think I've stole it, and also I'm gonna sell all my stuff as well. So, see you guys. Just a quick update, guys. Um, before I was actually gonna, uh, you know, set up the dining table, and everything, uh, like around here, I think. I think, yeah, I might set up here to be honest. Basically, uh, obviously, because I gained a level, like my uh, place reset. And uh, what was really funny is that I came across these orc bards and everything, and for some reason they just decided decided to attack my men and me. So it was really really strange. And um, they have some really good loot on them, like the greaves of the flame, and this one's got like uh, boots of insulation and everything. And so basically, it's going to be kind of cool because they're going to be like invading us and everything. So that's going to be pretty damn cool to be honest. Anyway, guys, I'll set up like you know everything else, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so I'm back. Uh, so yeah, I did actually set up the weapons place, and that is going to be here. Um, so yeah, as you can see, I've put in a few swords and also put in a staff, which I got from the, you know, aid case here because it obviously respawned itself because I gained a level. Um, I'll show you the dining area in a bit and just get to that place. There it is over there, as you can see, right over there. Um, also, another thing, what I've done is I've also set up my guards to make quarters at this location, so they'll like sleep and stuff. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, so here it is. Um, I try to make it as realistic as I can. Oh dear, what's going on here? Uh, but uh, yeah, as you can see, I got uh, you know a few bowls with like 
you know, food and that in, which is pretty cool, and, you know, the impaled chair set up, so I'm trying to make it like a tea, so, you know, I'll, I'll be at this end of the table while there's like a load of guys eating and stuff, um, I don't know what this place is, this part's gonna be yet, this might be another part of the dining area, but, uh, it might be just like a load of plates and everything, so you get your plates and shit like that, I'm trying to make it as realistic as I can, I know it sounds really sad, but, you know, I like doing stuff like this, because, you know, that's what I always used to want to do in this game, you know, is to... Good day. You know, set up my own like little castle of some sort, and you know just like make my own stuff, which is really cool. Uh, I mean, what the Battlehorn, Battlehorn Castle. I mean, that was great and everything, but you know you couldn't like buy your own. F well, you could buy your like rooms and everything, but you know it wasn't like one of those you know mods where you could you know because it, it was kind of the mod, but like you know it wasn't one of those mods where you could like buy your own furniture and place it wherever the hell you want. One thing I did really love about um. Uh, you know, Battlehorn Castle was like, you know, you, you renovated it, which is pretty cool. Um, I love that, and I always will, because, oh, it's just amazing, just, you know, seeing it in, like, pieces and everything, but then, like, you know, getting the money and, you know, spending, like, your gold on, like, like, you know, <laughs> you know, basically making the place look nicer and, you know, a lot better, and just seeing it, like, grow, if you know what I mean. And then, you know, seeing, like, all the statues of, like, the creatures you've killed and, like, like all the people, like, your servants and everything. So, yeah, it was really cool. Especially the bedroom, like, uh, you know, it's a one, like, you know, it's like a single bed, but then it turned into, like, a double bed afterwards with, like, like, bare, like, um, f you know, a, le a bear, like, <laughs> a rug and everything. So, yeah, it was really cool. That's what I really did like about that game. Uh, well, that mod, sorry. Well, Battle and Castle, anyway. So I don't know what to do today actually. Um I don't know. Oh shit, yeah, I still have a uh, god mode on. Um basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the district quickly and uh go there and uh sell some more stuff because I got a lot of stuff off of the uh, orcs which I uh, killed which tried to invade my place. Um hopefully they won't take the food if like a bunch of people come again. I hope they don't take the food which I put on the table, because that will just annoy the hell out of me, because I'll have to keep on replacing it, and they'll probably nick the bowls as well, because they're gay. <laughs> Could you imagine that, just going into, like, imagine just seeing, like, I don't know, like, see, in real life, I know this, wouldn't, I know this wasn't, wasn't like this in real life, but could you just imagine, like, say that this happened, like, back ages ago, like, back in the medieval times, and you had, like, a, a companion with you, and there was, like, a magical sword or something, and then there was a bowl, and he took the bowl instead of the magical sword. He was like, "Oh my god, look at this bowl! <laughs> it's amazing!" And just left the sword. I just, I just, I'd just be confused as fuck. <laughs> yeah, yep. uh, yeah, I did I make a lot of money uh, from selling my other stuff. Like, uh, I made eleven thousand, which is <laughs> pretty good. Um, so yeah, I. I'm really happy that I got quite a lot of shit off those guys actually. Well, as you can see, I, <laughs> I stole a lot of stuff from the crates outside so I can make it look a lot better. Um, look like you know the dining a place a lot better. That's so yeah. Right. Cruise of the flame. I'll take those. Uh, I will like enchant you my own armor soon. But, uh, you know, That's a good deal. do this, but, uh, actually, we'll s actually, you know what, I'll sell that, That's a I'll sell that, and I'll sell that, uh, I'll sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that, mm -hmm. sell that, la la, <laughs> uh, yeah, basically I'm going to wear all that. I might wear the Ranger leather gloves actually, because they're actually really cool. Um, actually, I've got anything else? Oh yeah. I mean, I'm not kidding. Fine like transaction. those orcs had good really good stuff on them. I don't know why I had. I don't know why I had silver spoons and everything, but don't ask me why. Uh, you know what I will do though. I think. Right, let me just set up my armor quickly. Err, yaw, yaw. And range leather gloves. That looks pretty sick, actually. 
Like that. Um, Alright, okay. Uh, I think I gave all my stuff to. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna give in that, 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 and that. So I don't have a lot of stuff on me. Um, yeah, I need to, like, sort out that and everything. Uh, give me my mutton. I don't really need that for now. Uh, venison weighs two. That's crazy. Alright, let's go. Um, I think I might buy some... Uh, I don't know. Should I buy some slaves? I guess I could, actually. Uh, slaves are actually really good. Uh, that's one thing I do like about this mod is that, well, the mercenary mod is that you can actually hire slaves, which is actually really cool. Um, I don't think they fight, but Venusian. Oh god, it's really cool. Um, Three hundred gold. That's not bad actually. It's basically, you should be appearing. Yeah, there he is. Nice. What? I might download a mod where you know there's animations where you can tell. These certain people to animate, you know, stuff like that, which is really cool. But uh, I think you can tell them to like mine. make potions and stuff. I don't think that's. Uh, I don't know. I'll just have two for now. Let's go. Uh, um, I'm also thinking of getting a wine, like a winemaker, because you know, in the Battle Horn Castle, you have that winemaker. I think, in, I think. What I might do is, I think I might nick him from the Bowhorn Castle. Sorry, I was drinking. Um, and then probably set him up in my place somewhere. I sell like tables with like wine and, and everything. Because in this playthrough, or well, this series, I'm hoping to like, well, in the first series anyway, I'm hoping to kind of like, you know, try and make this alien ruin come back to life. You know what I mean? I mean, there is that mod where it retextures the whole entire alien room. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> but uh, that lags up my game like loads if I have that on. But, uh, yeah. You know what I think I might do is, uh... Yeah, I need a place to Hello. put them down, actually. That's the thing. I think one thing I will do is, uh, possibly... Have the battle horn people as my allies, if you know what I mean. So they can be my allies, and it can also be a place to retreat if this place does get over. Fucking hell, they're here again, aren't they? Holy shit! Fuck, did they respawn or something? Mother of Lord. Fuck. Sure, I hope my men are okay. <laughs> yeah, I need to get rid of all these skeletons. Fuck, you took an arrow to the chest. Yeah, I think... It's not going to annoy me. The skeletons aren't going to annoy me because, like, it adds a bit of, like, you know, a bit of challenge to this place. Because, you know... Because, obviously, you know... I don't know, would skeletons appear in Alien Ruin? Would they, like, respawn? I mean, obviously they would respawn, of course, but, like... I'm just wondering, like, would they... You know... Would they come back to life when you... I don't know, I, I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I'm really, uh... Happy how this place is, you know, like... How I've set up all the things and all the, like... Items and everything. I like that. Uh... Oh no, oh come on, really? Oh, son of a bitch. He had to. Ugh. Oh god, he knocked the potatoes. Ugh. Oh. Ugh, oh, really? Oh god. Not the potatoes, come on. Yeah, I think that might be a problem. That. I think I might do is just How are you? unlock that and pick it up and just give that to him now because I don't want to carry it. Let me go. 
I want to see if these guys actually, you know, sit down and actually eat. Because I know they do. I want to see if they actually do it here. There's the thing. Please sit down. Well. Oh. Please. He's trying to. No, maybe not. <laughs> what if... You know what? I think I might have... I think what will happen is... I think... I bet you... Because they're all going down, right? I bet you they're going to try and sleep in my bed. So this is what they do. Right. Yeah, I think there's an entrance through here, right? You watch. Right, I'm going to skip an hour. And I bet you she'll be in my bed. She will... Oh, no, maybe not. <laughs> not that I... No, I don't want her in my bed, actually. Because, yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> God, no. But, uh... Going down. Oh, and there you go. <sighs> God, fucking hell. Uh, oh, no. Oh, God, no. I think what I will do, I think I might move that as well. Let's go inside. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm going to sort that out later on. Um, Right now, I just need to sort out where these uh, sevens are going. Fuck's sake, you spawned again. Fuck off. Uh, a, pl a pleasure to speak with you. Um, kill all. Patrol around here. Good day. <laughs> Go away. Farewell. Well. Okay, cool. Stop staring at each other like you fucking love each other. I think I will pick up. Oh no. Oh god. Oh, that's disgusting. Better sleep in my bed. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Yeah, what I will do, I will buy a load of beds and uh, get these guys to sleep in those, because I don't want them sleeping in mine. And that's just going to constantly annoy me. Alright, okay. Um, yeah, so this is a boring episode, guys. Obviously, there's not a lot of fighting going on. Um, you know, I'm just really saying, I mean, I could do this off camera, but I just want to show it, you know, just me, like, Making my stuff. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> right. Righty ho. Right, basically, I'm going to go out and I'm going to loot one cave for you guys because I know this is quite boring. Um, so I'll see you guys in a bit. See, just a little update. I'm not going to actually loot a cave. Basically, what I am going to do is I'm going to go to the Battlehorn Castle and help them defeat the Marauders. So I'll see you guys in a bit. So basically, I'm having these guys fight off the Marauders because I'm cool. Die, please. You going to fight me? Huh? You going to fight me? No? <laughs> <laughs> you move like a pregnant cow. I'm on your side. Okay, well that was exciting. Um That was very exciting. This is no time to Oh look, there's no uh, marauder over there. Let's go fight this marauder off. There's one last marauder. Guardian in. Oh shit. Fuck, do I still have god mode on? <laughs> I still do as well. Oh great. <laughs> I am messing this up today, aren't I? Um, Q. 
keep your guard up. Um, I don't see any more. Uh, so, hang on. Where now? This is no time to talk. Keep your guard. Don't see any more marauders. Not going to lie. Oh god, now who is messaging? Ugh. Okay, guys, this is basically what happens when uh, people see me that I'm playing a game and they want me to play a game which they want me to play with them. <laughs> it annoys me, and I should re and I should really be offline, but uh, you know, I forget about that. But basically, <laughs> I want to own this castle, please. Wait now, uh. This is no time to. T okay. You came. Where are the enemies? Really? There are no enemies here. Where? There's a marauder here. Any more? This is indeed a dark oh, day for Jesus. all left. But I thank you for risking your own life, Melts. Here, take this. As the newest master of the castle. I am now the owner of this place. Um, <laughs> that was a little bit strange. I actually thought that was a uh, battle horn guy. Um, but no, it wasn't. Um, that's really weird. Uh, yeah, so... This is obviously going to be another castle. Basically, what I, I might do in series two is probably come here and, you know, I probably won't know me because this is actually, you know, obviously vanilla DLC. And, you know, I could do that in my playthrough or whatever. But, um, yeah. Basically, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take this guy's sword and, you know. I think I'll take his stuff though, because I want to be. I want to live like a king. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's Harry. I thought it was. I knew it'd be him. I knew it would be him. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What I can't wait for is to bloody. Um, Oblivion Gates to open up if I do the. That part of the quest. Or if I get that mod where. It opens up all the main quests. Sorry about that. I was gonna burp. Uh, so basically, just to finish this off, I will actually go to one cave and you know just uh, you know scavenge that area to see if I find any loot. Um, basically, um, I think the Broken Promises cave is. Oh no, maybe not. Yeah, this is definitely a. Um, Oh shit, alright. Oh, I'm not dying, you can piss off. I'm not going to die. Help me, you bastards. Oh, fuck you then. Shit, there's way too many of them. What the fuck? Oh, this is a tad stupid. Oh, well, that's exciting. <laughs> oh, boy. That was a weird sound. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm drinking Mountain Dew because I'm awesome. Oh, man, I love the taste of Mountain Dew. Absolutely love it. I should get, like, sponsored by him and be like, yeah, what's up? Sponsored by Mountain Dew. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that was. Don't even ask me. Okay, then finally we'll just go to Black Rock Caverns and <laughs> if this isn't a bloody vanilla quest, because I absolutely hate it when they lock caves. Oh, this is. I is it? No, it's not. Okay, good. I thought it was. Cause it looked like a looked familiar for a um, place where there would be. Oh, nice. There's there's marauders and everything. Nice. This should have some good loot. 
Shit, I keep on hitting my own men. I'm really retarded at this. Nice, okay, what do we have? No. Actually, no, I will take the silver vase, actually, because vase, because that'll look nice on my uh, dining table. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, well. Deal with it. Err, uh, shack? What's in this? Glaive? Oh, actually, yes, I will, because, again, that will look nice. Oh, boy. There's a... No, I won't take the onion. I've got enough of those, bloody hell. Oh, come on, really? Well, that's just gay. Oh, I really don't want to go over time with this. I probably have. I've probably gone like 20 minutes over 30. Oh, this is going to be really gay. <laughs> oh, God, I'm going to die so easily. The reason being is because, like, Mart's. I don't know if it's Mart's mod. A pleasure to oh, no, go away. Um, I don't know if it's the Mart's you monster too. mod which is making these guys really hard or something like that, but my god, seriously. <laughs> he loves to add in a load of, like. I mean, I don't even have the, uh, like. Rapid, like even I don't even have the higher spawns on, and it looks like bloody crazy. It looks like a bloody party. Oh, well, what I'm trying to say is like you know I don't have the because basically what I'm saying is like um, Mars Monster Mod comes with uh you know like a load of ESPs, and uh, these range from you know zombies and that resurrecting to uh, you know. Basically, uh, you know, major spawns, so like a load of people spawn, which is just stupid. <laughs> and my computer can barely handle it. And uh, there's like loads. And in the in the first few part, in the, I think it was like the first one or two parts of in the first one or two parts of Surviving the Wilderness that on this series. Well, in the beginning of this series. Um, I had the major spawns on, or whatever the hell it's called, advanced spawns. I I completely forgot what it's called, but uh, yeah, I had higher spawns on, and that was why my computer was lagging quite a bit because. Oh come on! No 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 no! That is not happening. I'm not going to die. How's my men? Oh, so now they appear before I basically die. Die in a hole. Oh wow, a trap. I wonder what that does. I bet you my men will go into it. Oh, no, actually I don't want to because I'll probably kill my men. <laughs> I don't really think there's a lot in here, to be honest. To Marlene. Hmm. Never seen that gem before. Not bad, not bad. I'm getting quite a lot of loot from this place, which is nice. Uh, God, it's just thing been some kind of fucking. I'm supposed to go. There we go. I'll take the damage. There we go. Is that it? That's it. Oh yeah. 
Oh yeah. What's this in, eh? Okay, right. Uh, see you later, guys. Thanks for watching. Please try and like, subscribe. It'll help a lot. Uh, I probably might do another episode after this because, you know, I just feel like doing that. Uh, next week, there will be actually a schedule which I want to do. Uh, it will be like Monday, we'll be surviving the wilderness with Buster Move. I haven't done Buster Move in a long time because, you know, I haven't got really a schedule going down. Wednesday might be a mod review of some, like Tuesday will be like surviving the wait wilderness as well. Uh, I'm basically like trying to spread out all my videos throughout the week. So yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Um, you know, so anyway guys, check out Storm Gamer. Um, their Facebook and their Twitter. Brad is, is, Brad is releasing a beta soon for his website, I don't know when, but it will be somewhere in the beginning of this year. Um, also check out Region Clothing, my mate Owen has got his own clothing brand, he's got some really cool and sick styles, um, seriously, they are, are looking really good uh, by the day, and they're looking better by the day, sorry. Anyway guys, I'll see you later, thanks for watching, and...